Hey there everyone, Trentia here, and welcome back to Borderlands 2. So in the last episode, uh, we spent most of our time in here, South Boss Demon Power, killing a few assassins via various means. Today, however, we go back out to Three Horns Valley. Now, I believe, since I've been saving and quitting, this whole thing will be back. Oh, yes. Okay, so I slightly cower. Let me just get that nice bank shot. <laughs> okay, where is the guy that went up? The, the shotgun has tremendous accuracy, by the way. Only when you need it to, though. If I open up this, I can jump on the lid and just go, so we're good there. I guess they got bored. Oh, well, these guys, 10. Yeah, it's it's probably slightly worth it. Suicide Psycho, get out of here. Missing shots, get out of here. <laughs> gonna toss a nade out that way. Damn, too far. I keep holding down shift instinctively to... Like... Hold my breath, but that's not a mechanic at all in this game. Come on, pop it up again. Let's see it go. Dude, what a coward. He didn't aid them, dude. He could have had such a, you know, less prickly fate if he just would have stood up, showing me his damn head. Anyways, so today you can see that there's a question mark over there and we're gonna find out what that's all about we're gonna do some missions however I am legally required to go grab a vehicle from the catch ride that's right here <laughs> wow how did I miss that go ahead and get the rocket one and let's go train won't stop, train won't stop is definitely correct now then here we are in the Happy Pig Motel. The nice echo recorder. Pre-recorded message begins. Ah! The bloodshots are killing us! Ah! Pre-recorded message ends. You found the Happy Pig Motel, huh? Yeah, bloodshots wiped that place out, but good. After all, it kicked him out of sanctuary. You might be able to turn everything back on if you activate that steam pump. Well, let's try it out. Oh man, the steampunks ain't working either. I see your problem. And I'm gonna take this slow so as you can understand, alright? That thing's broke as hell. Well, yeah, better scavenge some replacement parts from the other pumps near the motel. Now, the valve you're looking for is way up at the tippy top of that pump. You have to climb your way up that thing like a snort happy redhead on a slag bin if you want to get at it. Some scag like turned off our steam pump. Perfect. All right. Let's hope this goes well. <laughs> Alright, so... Where is... There you go. So this mission, as you can guess, from looking at the mini-map, we have to go to several different areas in order to get the things to fix that. Uh, whatever the hell that was. I'm very good at paying attention. So I guess let's get the let's get the worst one out of the way first. And I don't mean that one. That one's easy, but as far as the other two are concerned, this one requires we fight a badass Bullymong. So let's go do it. What's up, Alpha Skag? Well, I mean, he's gonna run you over. I know I get like zero experience for killing you like this, but I love it when you splash my windshield. Krieg's taking the words right out of my mouth today. Okay, and help. Who wants, who wants a piece? I'm hearing racks, I'm hearing skags. I will kill every single one of you. Uh, let's wait till I reload this damn shotgun. You're going down, Rack. 
Alright. That means your friends are going to come out to play. And I'm down with that. Alright, they're all done. Let's grab this gearbox. Ah, you went and found the gearbox, huh? Man, those gearboxes are sure all the cats on Forsaken Roar, as we won't stay around here. Go ahead and plug her in! And now for the capacitor. Which is conveniently on the exact like, opposite side of this. And then keep that little town down there in mind for later. Alright, I'm gonna keep my car parked over here just so I don't blow it up on accident. I do that quite a lot. And so as you can see, we have a lot of guys around us. Alright, so there we go. We got all the pieces now. We've murdered at least a good chunk of the skag population of this area. So let's go put those things where they belong. Back in my happy pig motel land. And now these guys over here, they just kind of keep respawning. I might have to take care of them. That's a fair enough assessment, I guess. All I gotta do is replace the steam valve and then turn the thing on. Pump's ready to go, man! Just turn it on and watch the sparks fly! And there we go. Let's go ahead and turn this in. We get a skin, which I don't need. Hey, you! Here's a failable mission. Milch uh, so yes, this mission can be failed. Bloodshots just crippled my last courier, Dino. I'll pay you if you mail these packages out quick enough. My now that's a job I am willing to take. Kid. These are all things that don't matter to me. Let's just go ahead and sell that. Let's go ahead and get some ammo up. Check back later. So this should be fun. Now normally I'd be like, oh, I need to park the car and be ready, but not today. So remember that little village town thing I told you to keep in mind for later? Well, later is now. Also, what's up, Nomad? Get fucking run down and get caught in my car. Alright, yeah, let me just jump in through the boat. Okay, so no shield this mission sounds like a damn nightmare. However, I believe this mission increases time for each item you put away. So let's just go ahead and not die right here. And go run to the first mailbox. Let me just uh, hold that these guys are as bad as the shots as some of the guys I was playing with in PUBG earlier. Buddy and I were just kind of sitting at this group of houses, just kind of hanging out. I had an AUG. And this group started shooting at us and just could not hit us and then they moved a hill more and they still couldn't hit us so it was pretty good and then we died anyways to the squad that killed the guys that were on the hill shooting us originally okay look i'm just gonna slice you up put this in okay so i don't think time is actually increasing i'm thinking of a different mission so we really gotta hurry this one up so what up here, go around, up to the top, we'll come back for that. Okay, no, 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 time is going up. Right. Uh, can I please just get up? Right. Do a drop down. Racks are going to try to attack me and fail miserably. I don't know if anyone's back there, but if there is, we're getting bombed. Well, hopefully by the time I'm done with this, my buzz axe is back. Ah, well, I guess this is it. Unfortunately, 
Fit as a fiddle, he is. Anyway, kid, your severance is in the mail. Cool, thanks, man. Well, I mean, if it's pistols, I ain't gonna need a damn lick of it. At least for a few more levels, probably. Alright. The sniper rifle's starting to show its age. Body shots aren't one-shotting people. What? I mean, okay, psychos aren't smart. It's good that we're off, you know. That's immediately a thing that you know if you play this game, but... Wow. He was just shooting a door. Any cool colors over here? No. Alright, so let's go check out the other weapon chest. Given I doubt, I'm gonna find anything much better than what I have, so it's actually a waste of time, but... It's called fluffing for time. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, what's this? Shotgun ammo, which I need, I guess. Hello, item chest. Well, if only any of you are good. I mean, okay, that's to be fair, they're probably good weapons, but they don't mean anything to me. Not this time, at least. Uh, shut up. <laughs> okay. Just slice up a suicide psycho and run. Don't you run from me. Okay, just sit there, because I can't kill you anyways. Okay, just gonna kill this guy, just to make myself feel better about that damn alt. Is that over there? It is. What are you doing over there, Nomad? And... Done. Another weapon chest up here. Ah, grenade mods. Also known as, I'm not picking them up. And I think there's something else up here. No, just some mailboxes. Oh well. Well, I guess that, uh... Deals... That? That that deals that? No. That, uh... What the heck am I trying to say? I don't know. I'm trying to say something along the lines of, That settles that. Hmm. Weird how the words come to you when you think of it. At least in this scenario. And hey, at least thankful this water isn't uh, poisonous to my life, because it's not too cold. Now the real question is, will this mission level me up? Also, can I get out of the boat? Now we're out. What's up, Skaggs? Eat car. Really? You guys just can't live without picking a fight, huh? I'm not just gonna let you go. You shoot at me, I, I take you out. I'll take you out from your foot. <laughs> what a way to live life. Alright. Use that. Uh, I'll level up. I'm gonna sell that just so it doesn't auto equip. Well, I'm gonna pick that so it doesn't auto equip. Wow, you are really just asking for it. Alright, now I believe that is actually it for this area for right now. So I guess our next goal is to go to the Firehawk. So I'll, I'll at least get there before I end the episode. I could just fast travel. It, it would be quicker. So we're going to go fast travel. Well, actually, would it? Yes. Yes, it would be. I don't gotta wait five seconds to fast travel, because I'm not playing co-op. Alright, let's just deploy it again. And here we go. I'm hoping I level up on the way in there. Like, if I'm, like, just shy of level 13, I'm gonna be... kinda sad, honestly. I mean, there is a bit of a fight we have to do to get in here, so maybe I'll get lucky. Now, this next section introduces a new kind of enemy, as far as these, uh, you know, bandits are concerned. And I believe that's pretty much... Yep, there they are. Well, no, that's a burning psycho. They're still fire-based, though. I guess it's a midget. Where, where are the Nomad Pyros? Well, they apparently are just really shy. There we go. 
The Nomad Pyro. Uh, those guys aren't really a problem until you have to do a later mission. Later side mission, I should say. But even then, you just ignore them. I mean, I guess to be fair, the only time they're really a big problem is when uh, you do... <laughs> well, I guess in my case, uh, I was doing a Malawan Allegiance run. The Firehawk should be around here somewhere. Stay alert. That's yeah. weird. The Bloodshot Bandit Clan seems to be attacking the Firehawk's lair. They've probably left landmarks for yeah. reinforcements. Those should be due to the Firehawk. That or just follow the screaming. Step off, Vault Hunter. This is between the Bloodshots and the Firehawk. <laughs> Once my boys bring his ass back to me, he's gonna pay for every bloodshot he killed. We're gonna string him up from his own freaking intestines! Well, that was... <laughs> 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 